This weekend, many families may enjoy cookouts or a round of golf to celebrate Dad and thank him for all that he does. Mm -hmm. But for some children, Father's Day is hard when your dad is behind bars. Center on your side, Sasha Tolliver is here with a program connecting kids with their dads, at least for this special day. Right, so this week, every inmate at the Virginia Peninsula Regional Jail will get to video chat with their fathers or loved ones for free of charge. And while it normally costs by the minute, the superintendent, like I said, made it for free. He says he doesn't judge them for their situation and hopes this opportunity gives them the insight that they need. Being away from your loved ones on special holidays can be difficult for anyone but can be especially hard for those behind bars. Um, not all are bad. Mm -hmm. yeah. Good many made bad choices, and they will answer for those choices. But while they're here, what can we as a team, administration team, do to help alleviate some of that pressure that builds up. That's why Virginia Peninsula Regional Jail Superintendent Tony Pham partnered with a company that makes their tablets to get each inmate a free five minute video chat in honor of Father's Day. It's hard to be in jail as it should be, but that doesn't dictate to folks on the outside to be able to understand that it's okay to give them moments. Elizabeth Bellamy says she's grateful for the opportunity to talk to her dad, who's her role model, because otherwise her family couldn't pay for it. It helps me focus on why I want to better myself and get out and be a part of my family again. Carissa Scott agrees. Those five minutes are priceless. Yeah, I'm happy, happy tears that I'm able to see my father. I mean, able to tell him I love him and I'm sorry that I'm in this predicament and I just want to, I'm blessed. And for fathers like Darius Radcliffe, he is counting down the moments till he gets to see his five-year-old baby girl. It's a joy, actually. You know, and, and you know, when you're somewhere like here where you're doing, you know, some time and stuff like that, when you're sitting for 12 months or more, it gives you that white light at the end of the tunnel. Sam also made this happen on Mother's Day and even Christmas last year. He says he hopes to continue these heartwarming moments. I'm Aisha Tolliver, 10 on your side.